Hey everyone! Hi. You see it. <laughs> we'll see what it looks like. Elegance. Beauty. Crown Zenith. Hey guys, welcome back to the Chatterbox Hobby Shop. I have just been super swamped and stressed between voiceover, school, and the hobby shop. Ah, uh, man, there, there's been so much that I've been trying to get on track and so many things that I've been trying to do. I've been trying to maximize my efficiency and, and, and minimize my distractions so I'm able to put out YouTube videos as well on top of those other things. Uh, so what I have for you in this video today isn't very streamlined. It's kind of a, a hodgepodge of like four different videos that I had made that I wanted to put up here. But now it's just turning into a backlog of stuff that I need to get edited. So I'm just going to throw this up for you because I thought it was pretty awesome. These videos are still pretty great. And uh, and real quick, before we move into that, uh, did anybody watch the Pokemon Presents? Well, the Pokemon Presents, uh, it had some news about Pokemon Sleep, which is kind of weird. There was this really creepy, like, demonic Pikachu animatronic thing. Like, <laughs> what was that about? And then there was a reveal of Pokemon Classics, which is kind of like a board game, uh, Battle Academy style accessory or like card set, like a special set that just has three battle decks uh, based on the original OG Charizard, Venusaur, and Bulbasaur, which looks pretty awesome. I'm comparing it to the Battle Academy only as a collectible, you know, and people are gonna actually buy it. Uh, there was also some Scarlet and Vi Violet DLC stuff introduced and some other stuff for like Pokemon Go, Pokemon Live, Pokemon, uh, I can't remember the MOBA that they came out with. Uh, Unite, there we go, Pokemon Unite. Okay, before I go any further, I need to make a shout out to the two coolest customers that I have. They're, they're a couple of my regulars, they show up every week, and they surprised me uh, this, this past weekend with a special gift. What is that? I want to give you this. Oh my gosh, really? <laughs> that is so cool. Oh, it's on original 150. Nice. Oh, dude. Oh, oh man. That is so cool. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm gonna have to. Oh man, I got I got some stuff to hang us up actually right now. Hey. How you doing, man? Yeah, where, where should I put it? Yeah, what do you think? Uh, what do you think oh, would be a good place man, to put it? Skip, uh, they brought me a framed poster of the original 151 and my expression was epic. I, I, I didn't expect it at all and it meant so much and I couldn't even like, it was still early, I was kind of tired, I didn't sleep well the night before and that was like a shot of caffeine to my veins. Just. The, the generosity, uh, you, you guys are awesome. I can't think, I can't possibly tell you how much that meant to me. Okay, now that we got that taken care of, let's go on to some upcoming releases. So the Mimikyu EX box, the first EX box we're gonna see, is gonna come out pretty soon, followed by the World Championship decks, the Cyrus and Clara Premium Tournament Collections, and the Galarian Birds tins. These are gonna be the best parts, in my opinion, of Crown Zenith. The promo tins for these are insane. I, I can't, I don't even know how to describe this Moltres. You thought the Chilling Rain Moltres alt art was awesome? This one is gorgeous. I thought this was gonna be in the Galarian Gallery, but it's just a promo card, which I believe is awesome. I don't care if this card doesn't soar to $100 or $200 in value. Everybody's gonna get a chance to get this amazing Moltres because it's gonna be a promo, and it's gonna be easily accessible and lower price, which personally I love. And then after that, March 31st, we have the release of Scarlet and Violet base set, which I, I'm super excited for. I've been having to put all the money from the shop aside for the last month and a half to make sure that I can fill that invoice. That's gonna be my biggest order of all time so far uh, because it's just gonna be massive. We're gonna have booster boxes, ETBs, booster bundles. We're gonna have sleeved boosters. We're gonna have uh, check line blisters, uh, three pack blisters, man, what else? I just can't wait because this is the first new generation that's going to be starting with me as an open brick and mortar LGS and, and I'm super excited and super hyped for this. The last big piece of news I have to tell you guys before we go to an opening video with Emma is free comic book day. 
So that's May 6th, and it's a Saturday, and I'm gonna finally have comics. I put a big order in for about 2,000 comics to be giving away. I'm gonna do a lot of advertisement and promotion for it. I'm gonna try to find a way to incorporate that into helping uh, a local shop that might be closing down and trying to help them get rid of some of their back stock as well. And uh, I'm trying to make it a big thing, you know, a raffle, some, some live music maybe, and just a buttload of free comics as well for everybody who comes in. And uh, yeah, we'll see how that works out. But thanks for watching so far. Let's move into an opening video with Emma. We got a bunch of stuff that we still haven't opened up from Sword and Shield that I have sitting aside. Emma! Hello? Hello? <laughs> Let me get these cards out of the way real quick. We got the Blastoise VMAX Battle this Box that came out a while ago. The Infernate V Box, that's pretty this recent. Along with the Deoxys VMAX and V-Star Battle first. Box. Which, I said oh. well, which one? Blastoise first? Yeah! Yeah, alright. Alright, start opening packs. I want this one, and now you have to. Same time? Pack battle? Yes. Alright. We both have Wicko cards. Shell that. Love it. Dig it. Skinny. Oh, we both had white coat cards. We both got nothing. That pack you want. Whack pack. Another white coat card. Oh, I see! Oh, you definitely got better than I did. It's nothing great in that battle box. I still really wanted to get that. Uh, I won. I won yeah. the battles. I only opened that box uh, for that Blastoise promo. The Blastoise promo, though, was pretty, pretty nice. Oh. Deoxys? All right. Yay! What? What do you want? I want. Here we go, pack battle. Oh man, I know I got something good. Oh, oh! I got a doubler. At least I got a reverse. You you won one, so I won one. So now we're now we're no, I won. Or Beetle V Max Trainer Gallery card and a Del Fox V. All right, here we go. Brilliant Stars versus Lost Origin. Oh, oh, no, oh we both won. Wait. Nice! You got the Trainer Gallery Pikachu, and I got a Kindler can't, Secret Rare. Can't we just put them right here so both of us can reach the energies? Okay. Oh yeah, sorry. Sure. Alright, alright. Daddy, look at me. The Spirit Fingers. That was a good box right there for sure. So we still got five promos to add to our promo binder. Let's see. Which ones do you want? Alright, so I get Astral and Fusion Strike. Two Lost Origins. Here we go. Do both the same so they go with the same. In the same pile. Oh, nothing. Last packs. Here we go. Last pack battle. Oshawott, Scyther, Stantler, Yanma, Hoot Hoot, Magnemite, and Darkrai. Yeah! You got a hit too? What'd you get? Oh, a doubler! You got a Radiant Steelix and a Kyurem V. Nice. I thought I was going to win that pack battle even though it wasn't a pack battle. But it would have been you who won anyway. Oh no! It was a tax battle, actually. Oh, you see. Won that one then? I thanked you. I thanked you. Uh oh. That car alarm was going off. Oh man, I must have. I got too excited and I pressed my alarm button in my pocket. <laughs> did, you, did you hear that? Yes, My car was alarm was going off. All right, let's keep this train going. We still have plenty of time. So let me go first. So what's one? You pick. I Here we go. Am I like what am I doing? Ooh, ooh, you got something? I know, I see. Let's see what you got. I got nothing. A Trevenant. I love this and a this. A Trevenant V I from Evolving Skies. We still have more time. Let's do this again. Are you sure? All right, how about this? If we're gonna keep going, we can only do one more. Wow, I'm gonna get these. I'm gonna get this. Well, go for it, let's see what you got. I have a reverse. I wanna see if you got good luck and you can get an alternate, get the, that Gengar. This time it's my turn. You're gonna burn through them before I can even get these packs sleeved up. Yeah, I got nothing and you got something. You got a Cinderace. A Cinderace. I'm buying everyone because look, I'm buying them. All right, last pack. It's a Chilling Rain. I already got pretty much all the good pulls from Chilling Rain. I think the only one I'm missing might be that Zapdos uh, alternate, but we'll see what we get. 
Nothing, Kakuna. Well, that's it for today. We opened uh, four boxes of stuff that I still hey, needed the promos for. Daddy, do you know why it's like this? What? It's a V Union card. It's four cards that come together to make one. Yes, it's a puzzle. Yeah? You guys know what time it is. Now let's see what card we got I made. Hey everybody, instead of showing some cool footage of the cards we got during this video, I'm gonna show you some footage of the cards that we've got all together over the last week from the hobby shop. So, as a lot of you may know, running a Pokemon store or a card store or a game shop, uh, you gotta have a singles case. Selling singles is a big seller, especially for kids. You know, uh, not even just for people who actually play the game. But think of it this way. A lot of kids can realize that they can either buy a card they want or a decent V for their collection for just a dollar to maybe two dollars at most for you know one of the regular V's uh, maybe five dollars for some stuff like trainer gallery cards or alt arts or your full full art trainers you know but then it goes a little higher and higher but what I'm what I'm trying to say is my singles case gets just torn through on a weekly basis so I've had to buy cards so what I do is I'll buy cards for store credit at face value of market price, or I'll buy them if somebody wants cash. I'll buy them for cash at 30% below market price. Because either way, I want to make sure I maintain 25 to 30% profit margins to keep the shop growing. But we're going to show the cards that we picked up either from the last video that me and Emma did, or from the shop. I think it's only about five of these cards are actually ones that me and Emma pulled, but the rest of them, you're going to see there's some pretty good cards that we got from, uh, from our haul for the week from the shop. So here we go. We're starting with a Radiant Eternatus and a Radiant Jirachi. And if you guys notice, these are all the nice platinum sleeves. I've got a big, uh, over here, I've got a bunch of the other sleeves that people have put stuff in. But I transfer all my cards over from any other sleeve into the, uh, the Ultra Pro Platinums because they're just their choice. They're so, they're so much better. Uh, Z Zashian V, another Zashian V, two different ones. One of them is the, uh, I think this is from one of the tins. The Legends of Galar tin, I believe, was uh, a Zashian V. And this is the Zashian V from Silver Tempest. We got another Silver Tempest Galar Gallery. We got, not Silver Tempest, sorry guys, sorry, Crown Zenith is what I was saying. This is Silver Tempest. A Flaffy from the Trainer Gallery. Ooh, Magnazone from the Galar Gallery. Baby Pikachu from the Galar Gallery. We got an Alchemy V Rainbow Hyper Rare from Shining Fates. An Oricario, Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest, Silver Tempest. There we go. We got Bidoof, Voltorb, and Oricario. We got an Alolan, an, Al an Alolan Executor V from Pokemon Go. Another Pokemon Go Rainbow, Blanche. Another Pokemon Go, Radiant Blastoise. We've got some brilliant stars. We've got some, shoot, Darkness Ablaze? Forgive me if I'm wrong. Galarian Slowbro V. We got Pokemon Go, Chilling Rain. We got the Promo Luminion from the uh, the Trainer's Toolkit. We got the Dawn Fan from Celebrations. Salamance from Darkness Ablaze. Again, forgive me if that's the wrong set symbol. A Blissey V Full Art from Chilling Rain. A Brawly Rainbow Rare from Chilling Rain. We've got some Astral Radiance action, the Trainer Gallery, Mighty Ina, Dark Rai V from Astral Radiance, a Zeraora from Chilling Rain. Oh, this is the big haul of the day. This was a $70 card. The kid got away with two Pikachu VMAX special collections from Crown Zenith and a first partner pack in trade for that card. Uh, a Lugia V, the the V from uh, Silver Tempest, not not the not not the super sought after alt art, but something still pretty good. Beauty Full Art Trainer from Vivid Voltage, Lost Origins, Set of Scorch V Max from Trainer Gallery, that is a choice card. Rayquaza from Evolving Skies. Uh, we got some Chilling Rain, some Astral Radiance. We got that emo boy from uh, from Astral Radiance. A uh, a Greedent from Fusion Strike, the Full Art. Lugia Full Art from Silver Tempest. Eternatus VMAX, another rainbow rare from Darkness Ablaze. Ooh, Aroma Lady from Evolving Skies. A Kindler from Brilliant Stars. So, Red Couple Regular Vs, there we go. We got some uh, Astro Radiance, some Fusion Strike, and Evolving Skies. And that was our haul for the week in cards. Most of these cards are gonna have to go back to the single shelf because, uh, as I mentioned before, uh, they get face value for store credit when it comes to uh, trade-ins for store credit. That's because the profit margins for these sales come from the sealed product. 
uh, I still buy it wholesale. They still buy at retail price. There's still a 20 to 30% markup in between, and that's where the incentive for the sale is, for me at least. Uh, but that still means that I have to sell these cards. If I don't sell the cards, I'm still making a loss. Uh, so that's that's one of the things that people need to understand about singles and for you know doing trade-ins is I still get some cool cards and I still pay you market price, but I still have to sell these cards, you know? And if market price is going down on some of these cards, that means I'm potentially taking a loss. So I make sure I'm very fair, you know, when it comes to pricing out my cards and stuff with what I buy. Thanks for coming and checking out some Pokemon news with us and joining us for a pack opening. Thanks for watching this video! Thanks for watching this video! Thanks for watching this